Mother, can you hear me? Oh, perfect. Mm -hmm. Hello. Hello, skinny. Okay, I am going to exercise and and can everyone hear me? I'm on the I'm a gay on the throne. Yes, okay, good. I'm going to take um I'm gonna spritz myself with some Woodhaven <laughs> and give you an update. So we just finished the first day of shooting for the uh first video. Uh one of uh, a few videos for the Help Me I'm Dying stage show, which premieres in Manchester, England on January 30th. It starts off with a UK tour. There's um, other dates, but we can't, I don't um, know for sure right now. But in terms of the UK and Ireland, we're going to Ireland, um, England, and Scotland, and Wales, um, all around the UK. And it's very exciting. So today we did a wonderful thing. We had Fina Barbatal and Jackie Beat there. And uh, yep, I wore the long wig and it was great for sure. Um, uh, I'm not gonna tell, tell you about the videos, just they're fun, they haven't, you know. And uh, so what else can I tell you? Oh, so if you have donated and you haven't received a thingy, um, so right now the the eccentric billionaire benefactors, many of them are still waiting on their Skype call, and rest assured it will happen. God's time. And um, there's a few people who have not received their t-shirts and stuff, and I will um, get in, um, in touch with them very soon. I don't have an assistant, so I have a ton of stuff to do. Um, I've thought about hiring another assistant, but I don't know. It's kind of not worth it. Um, so... There's, uh, what else is that? So, okay, so that's, um, that happened today. That was wonderful. Um, if anybody's looking for volunteer, well, that, we'll get into that later. It's too much drama for your mama. That's right. Okay. Um, so the next order of business is unrelated to this. Oh, no, no. Um, same stage show, Jush. Um, so if you are, Going to, if you've been in contact with production about being an extra in LA for the next day of shooting, which is um, December 8th or 9th, I can never remember, and Sam is fucking over it that I can't remember the dates, but that's just, there's a hole in my brain where single digit dates fall through. Um, December 9th, thank you so very much, Janelle Panto. Janelle Panto, ladies and gentlemen of the Philadelphia Pantos. The ten dancing toes of the incomparable, the legendary, and the inimitable Miss Jonelle Toes. Um, what the hell are you? Gucci Mane 22. I've got some startling news for you. I am indeed a gay who was born on this very day. And tonight I'll take a bite out of your thigh, if you might. Run for me and I'll kill you. Hello, Dyke Mom. Okay, so uh, if you've been in contact with production about being an extra on the st on the outdoor shoot, then um, that's wonderful. Um, for anybody who's wanting still to do that, I would encourage you to look at my Instagram because I have all of the relevant information there. It tells you how to get in touch with who and what to do. If you are gotten in touch with, and if you're not, then just I don't know, move on. Um, the next thing is that the Trixie and Katia show is enjoying critical success. I don't know. If it oh God, here we go. Uh, critical success across all platforms. So uh, that's fun. I hope you're watching. It's on Viceland. You should watch it all the time. Uh, second, I am starting a podcast. When it rains, it pours. Don't you think she should be a little bit concerned about oversaturating the entertainment marketplace? It seems like she's everywhere all the time. I'm sick of her! Well, if you are sick of me, Barbara, I encourage you to change the channel. Um, but I'm doing a podcast. It's called Whimsically Volatile. I hope nobody else sees that name. If they have, they can... Oh, they'll see me in, they'll see me in court. Ah. 
Um, and uh, it's going to be so much fun. I have all these great little topics and like little thingies and we have a jingle and my friend Leah did it and she's so cool and I'm really excited about it. Um, the platform that we're going to produce the podcast on is called YMHA and it stands for something very simple that you should be very well aware of at this point. It's your mom's huge ass! Huh. Enough about makeup. Let's talk about podcasts. So it's going to be good. Uh-huh. And then... Maybe Mr. Body killed the cook. Yes. How? Uh, I'm wearing a gray hat, so you're taking me seriously. <gasps> Sugar Bill Cosmetics. My plan has been foiled by witchcraft. Um, so the next thing we're going to do is that outdoor um, a video shoot. So I don't, many, I don't have really any updates about that. It's just happening still. And then... Um, uh, so the stage show is going to be really, really good, by the way. Like, oh, wait, this is what I want to talk about. Um, quickly. I have to take a shower. <laughs> um, so, you know, the, the, the way that the show is going to work is, um, it's not going to be a drag show per se. So I, 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 I realized many weeks ago, I was like, wow, I was thinking like, huh, you know, the show is mostly sold out, which is amazing. Um, I don't like to brag about that because it, you know, ebbs and flows. That's the way it will. But, um, the, the thing is, is that many people, and this is the truth, of course, because I, I know, um, many people bought a ticket to the show really having no idea what I do, what I would do in such a context. Like, I'm not going to lip sync and wiggle and do splits for like an hour and a half. That's really not how it's going to work. Um, there are a, a combination of videos, which are kind of interstitial, um, uh, markers that um, push the, the plot of the evening along and are relevant to the interests of uh, my fans. And then um, there's um, going to be live acts that are, I don't do really do stand up per se, but the show is gonna make sense. That's the, uh, my point is that the show is actually gonna make sense. People I think are like, I like her, I don't know, she's cute and she's like random or whatever. <laughs> um, but those people are going to be challenged because the narrative flow of the evening is going to be very linear. Um, it's not going to be like an acid, it's going to be an acid trip in the sense that I look amazing and you're like, wow, I must be on psychedelic drugs. How is that possible? Um, but uh, no, it's going to look good. It's basically, it's going to cost a fucking fortune. Like I'm spending a fortune on this show and it's going to be amazing. And I'm like so pumped up about it. I am not on drugs. I am not. Um, under the influence of illegal narcotics in the state of California. And because of that, I'm able to achieve a level of productivity that is incredibly wonderful. And it's lovely and I love it. We had the best fucking time today shooting. The best fucking time. It was the perfect way to start out the shoots. It was like totally manageable. The production is um, that uh, Sam hired and me and we, the, we put together is incredibly well lubricated and this is an, uh, it's an oiled machine that will produce a lot of black gold Texas tea <sighs> it's gonna be fun and then oh the podcast will be about I think like an hour um shows coming to the USA yep I uh oh yeah any le any uh, questions any questions can't wait to see Fina Fina did amazingly today it was so good Mm, podcast is going to start. I'm not sure. I'm, I'm going to film it next week. Mm -mm. Do I believe in the devil? I certainly do. How many voices did you hear at any given time? Three. Yep, I'm going to bring it to... Oh, Trish will be in the show for sure. Um... Yep, Trish will be at Help Me, I'm Dying. She'll be nodding off by the dumpster. And then, um, can I say anything about the HBO show? Oh, yeah, I, I think so. I was, I mean, it was on Room, it's on Room 104. It's, so it's one little episode, because they do vignettes. They're in, there's, I think they're on their second season now. And it's, it's really cool. It was, I would, I'll gush about that when it's an appropriate time, because, ugh, that show fucking ruled. It was 
incredible. I grew up watching HBO. HBO literally, in like a very literal sense, shaped my brain. Shaped it. Like, I'm, I'm not joking. I'm not joking, bitch! What can I tell what can I tell you about the prophet ja Jasmine Masters? Easy. Um, eat some food, make some coins, smoke some weed, get your juice. Another poem. Oh, I wrote a poem on Twitter. Let's see if I can remember it. Tonight it is the super moon. Our love will be over very soon. Perhaps by tomorrow, right before noon. And if you think this message makes me sound like some crazy star struck loon, I politely encourage you to take that comment and shove it inside your mother's poon. <laughs> okay, goodbye. Skinny legend can't figure out how to swipe down.